Cave dog owners take note of outbreak of the highly contagious respiratory disease known as kennel cough is infecting dogs on Oahu. Jen Beniza tonight tells us what you need to know to protect your four-legged friend from getting sick and how to treat them if they do fall ill. Jen? Dash, I reached out to more than seven veterinarians and pet clinics around Oahu. All but one clinic reported a spike in cases of kennel cough. And the majority of the cases are on the windward side of Oahu in Kailua. It's a, it's a very distinctive kind of hack. <coughs> it's very <laughs> distinctive, best way I can put it. It's not a bark. It's nothing else. That distinctive cough is the primary symptom of kennel cough, a highly contagious oh, respiratory gosh. disease that's infecting no, no. dogs around Oahu. 14-year-old Koa came down with kennel cough after her housemate, Chika, contracted it. She just sl sleeping with me, woke up three, four times, really loud cough, hack, and then, <coughs> and that's how I noticed something was wrong. Both Koa and Chika have kennel cough, but they are not alone. I reached out to veterinarian Candace Dunham at Kailua Animal Clinic, who tells me they have treated between 10 and 15 cases of kennel cough in the last two weeks. Makai Animal Clinic also says they've seen more cases than usual. So how do you know if your dog has kennel cough? The main symptom is the honking cough, sneezing, runny nose, eye discharge, and in more severe cases, you may see lethargy or loss of appetite. The most typical cases that we see are very mild and self-limiting. Um, patients that are immunocompromised or younger patients, as, such as puppies, might be more susceptible to the more severe form. To help protect your dog from kennel cough, it's suggested that you get both the Bordetella and the para-influenza vaccines. I learned that you should vaccinate your dog at least five days before you put your dog in boarding or daycare. But the vaccine does not guarantee your dog will not get sick. It typically will prevent them and limit their infection um, to a subclinical infection, which means that they don't experience symptoms or a milder infection. But no vaccination, unfortunately, is 100% protective. But that was the thing. She had all her shots and she still somehow contracted it. Dr. Denham says if your dog does have kennel cough, try to avoid interaction with other dogs since the disease is highly contagious. The best way to disinfect the area once your dog is sick is by using a bleach solution of about a half a cup of bleach to one gallon of water. Jen Boniza, K2N2 News.